right, peace. Peace. All right, introduce yourselves. Okay. I'm Kaheem Knowledge Self Outlaw. My name is Ramel Self. Okay. And uh, so tell me a little bit about the history of like how you got, well, first tell me how I you two met. <laughs> well, we basically grew up together. Uh, I've, I've known Ron Mel since I was about, I started coming around him. About eight, around, nine years old? No, a little bit older, a little bit younger than that. Maybe younger than that. Yeah, it was about, about seven. About seven years old. <laughs> and um, we were always close. Um, like I said, I lived around the corner from him, but I grew up at his house. You know, I grew up, you know, I spent most of my nights in his room. <laughs> you know, so, wow. you know, uh, Knowledge Divine was like my big brother, too. You know, we got out of line, he kicked my behind like he was his. <laughs> Everybody else. <laughs> that was the same thing. And would look after all of us the same way. Absolutely. Absolutely. When things went, when things went wrong. We knew who we could call him. And he was going to be there. <laughs> That's right. That's base. That's base. So you were telling me about this story that led up to you giving the knowledge yourself. Yes, sir. So, wow. You figure... We was all of, he figured 1969, God. And uh, the city was in an uproar. The Black Panthers had came to town. And uh, I asked my mom, could I be a Black Panther? And she said emphatically, no. Because <laughs> my mom was afraid of the police. <laughs> my mom wasn't afraid of the police. My mom was a, she was very cautious of mm -hmm. everything. And uh, Black Panthers meant police knocking down your door. Mm -hmm. So that was emphatically no. So as a result of that, me and my brother and a couple of them, me, Kaheem, and a couple of us, we started our old thing called Panther 2. Yeah. And it was kind of a, a replica. I was Minister of Information. I think, what was you, Kaheem? You was Minister of what? I think maybe communication or something communication, like that. Something was Greg good. wanted to be Huey, so he was Minister of Defense. Mm -hmm. He went out and bought a shotgun like Huey. <laughs> And we had a chair, we had the whole thing. <laughs> so like you said, you were, you were, you were well read, so you read up on how the Panthers formed their oh, organization yeah. and everything. Yeah. And, and, and well, the Panthers really came from Malcolm. That was their inspiration, by any means necessary. However, but, but the people do not realize the Panthers was about the same thing that's going on now, is policing the neighborhood, policing the police, and feeding the children. Absolutely. A lot of people miss, they lose that on the path. All they think is the gunfights. But the well, gunfights was the breakfast program. The breakfast program was rampant across the whole nation. Rampant across the whole nation. And uh, no, these these were very attractive. But attractive in a in a positive way. Yeah, but we grew up in the streets where we were watching our people being beaten on a regular basis, you know. And please. Oh, absolutely, all the time. I mean, men, women, children, it didn't matter. So, I, I guess the best way to say it is that we were dissatisfied. That's good. <laughs> you know, we were totally like dissatisfied. Like God was saying about us, it wasn't really anger, it was more of a dissatisfied. We were dissatisfied mm -hmm. with what was going on. Mm -hmm. and, that, and that led us to, uh, to exploring mm -hmm. ways to uh, get people to know that we were dissatisfied or whatever that may be. And, um, and at the same time that we, we were forming the Panther too, we were also still uh, you know, looking to find answers. You know, I remember um, you started, you started, remember all the artwork you started mm -hmm. doing, you know, uh, mm -hmm. when you did the all-seeing eye and mm -hmm. things of that sort. We didn't know what it all was about, but we knew there was something here, there was something we were something missing going on. You know, I studied Buddhism, Hinduism, yes. a few other <laughs> religions. All, all at the isms. age of... Oh, we was, I was 16, 17 years old. 16, 17 years old. That's before a, the knowledge. Yeah, before the knowledge. Yes, yeah. sir. Looking to find what... What's, what am I missing? What am I missing? <laughs> and nothing was satisfying us. We were so frustrated that by the time that um, um, I was just about ready to turn 18. Ramel was 17, Ramel was 18. And we all decided it was time to go. We got to, we got to move on, we got to grow up, we got to, we got to make, our, make our move. Right. You know, the first, thing, the first thing we decided to do first was we have to take an action in this city. We have to let them know that we're here. You know, that's what led to the, the incident.
that, that Brother Mel told you about, <laughs> you know, the broad <laughs> method. <laughs> wow, wow. Yes, and, and, and it, like I said, God, it was, it was all bridal, it was all in the pursuit of righteousness. <laughs> I like this synth mega, do it again. To see the entire complete film that these segmented clips come from, join 7 On Demand. Add on with me as we take our media to the next level.